yes, uh, in Shawshank Redemption, because the problem was he was, first of all, uh, apparently he was uh, in the prison because he was accused falsely and uh, sentenced to double life sentence, if I remember, for doing what? For killing his spouse, all right? In a rage because he caught her with a uh, a golf player, and he was drinking while you know when he caught him, and so he didn't. He said he testified that he didn't remember anything about what happened. He intended to kill him, intended to kill her maybe and whoever, whomever she was with, mm-hmm. but he didn't remember doing it. But that was his intention, and it turned out that he found out later in the movie that somebody else killed him while he was in a drunken stupor, all right? So apparently he was not what you might call a homosexual, because, you know, I guess, uh, in the movie, because he had a spouse that he said that he loved very dearly. Okay, but in the prison itself, he was sodomized by force. And that happens a lot in prisons, I understand, particularly when you, with young black males who go in I mean, they they just wait for them. <laughs> they they just line up and wait for them and say, "Oh, you're going to be mine. <laughs> you're going to be mine, whether you want to or not. You are going to be mine. I'm going to be your cellmate, and I'm going to do a job on you, and you ain't going to be able to do nothing about it. Sorry about that. You shouldn't have taken this trip in here. You should have thought about that when you got in this mess that you got into. But I mean, hey, we all in here for something." So the law of the jungle is in here. So, hey, if you're tough enough to fight me off, more power to you. So this goes on, I understand, around the clock, everywhere, that you have prisons all over the world, okay? And uh, so getting back to Shawshank Redemption, yes, I, I, from what I could see, he did have a sex problem because when you're being forcibly sodomized, I mean, sometimes what they call gang rape, which Andy the Frame in the movie was, uh, he had a problem, but he figured out a way how to solve that problem, because he, 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 he was tired of being treated that way, okay, which correctly so. So how did he solve it? He had to go use the power of the people who had put him in there and used them to defend him from the people who were raping him. And he did that by doing what? By getting in their favor. So that was his strategy. He worked out that strategy. Hmm. I don't think, uh, from what I can remember about the the storyline, it wasn't, he didn't deliberately do it. He kind of fell into it, and he said, well, oh, yeah, in order for me to help them, help these guards, and I'm helping these guards with their taxes and whatnot, their income taxes, and helping them to save money, all the guards in the prison. Now, uh, you know, I have a little industry going on here, and so in order, I have to be in good health, and they have to protect me in order for me to do favors for them like do their taxes. So that's when the head of the guards took the chief sodomizer out of action by almost beating him half to death, (laughs) saying, hey, you messing with my business now. Say, I don't mind you sodomizing Andy the Frame, but Andy the Frame is working for me. So if he's working for me and you are doing harm to him, I'm going to do a job on you. Yes with this nightstick, which is what he did. Dragged him out of his, uh, into his cell and proceeded to beat him with an, a billy club until he was incapacitated. Broken this, broken that. Actually, what was the line in the movie? According to uh, Red, said, Bob, who was a sodomizer, spent the rest of his days eating his meals from a straw. 
that 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 ruined his sodomizing business. <laughs> but uh, from protection from the very people who were uh, imprisoning him and mistreating him. But see, he said, "How can I get out of this? How can I get some relief?" And so I can get some relief, and get some relief even for Red and some of the other prisoners yeah. by having doing little small things for the guards who are guarding me. 